Hello roller coaster enjoyers alike and welcome back to the B3 channel. Today we've got some absolutely mind blowing news straight from the heart of the theme park world. I'm your host Ben and today we're diving into this crazy revelation that Alton Towers' next roller coaster is going to be none other than a groundbreaking RMC design. So grab your seatbelts because we're about to unravel all the exciting details shared by none other than the legend John Byrne himself. And also we'll have a quick chat about what an RMC actually is. Let's get into it. Wait, just before we begin, make sure you press that subscribe button. It'll be greatly appreciated, and I've heard that if you don't subscribe right now, then Alton Towers will never get an RMC. Anyway, I hope you're sitting down for this one, because Alton Towers is about to take things to a whole new level. Our beloved theme park has possibly teamed up with the ingenious minds at Rocky Mountain Construction to deliver what could well be an absolute game changer in the world of roller coasters. During a recent Q&A with John Burton on the Merlin Backstage YouTube YouTube channel, the question was asked, when will we see an RMC design at a park? This then led John to say that he can't be mentioning anything potentially on the horizon. He then drinks out of a cup with an RMC logo on it. Just check out this clip. So a lot of you have asked, when will we see an RMC design at a park? Can we, can we cut the camera? We can't be talking about anything potentially on the horizon. So there's quite a bit we can unpack from this. As John mentioned, he can't be talking about anything potentially on the horizon. Now, this is a nod towards the project code name for the next roller coaster, Project Horizon. Project Horizon is going to be located in a building on the Alton Towers site where there currently isn't anything developed. They've specifically put it in a building to ensure the coaster is hidden and it also will reduce the noise for the local residents. But it also means that there is a huge canvas for a potential mind-blowing theme. But let's just go back a minute. Who is John Burton and what is an RMC? Well, John Burton's job role is the creative lead for Merlin Magic Making. This essentially means he's a roller coaster and attraction designer for Merlin. He has worked on rides such as the Curse at Alton Manor and Nemesis, but possibly his most impressive creation yet is the world of Jumanji at Chessington World of Adventures. John is also working on Project Horizon. He loves filling rides with Easter eggs and also teasing what could lie ahead for future developments. This is why it's so exciting that John has mentioned an RMC. That being said, what actually is an RMC? RMC stands for Rocky Mountain Construction and they're a roller coaster manufacturer from the United States. They're known for their one of a kind innovative designs and you can tell if a roller coaster is an RMC from a mile off. They sometimes transform old wooden roller coasters into more exciting hybrid roller coasters. This involves both wooden structure and steel components such as the track to make it a hybrid roller coaster. This then gives them room to add elements such as inversions which would previously have been impossible. RMC roller coasters are well known for their one of a kind hybrid design, innovative world's first elements, smoothness, intense airtime, reimagining existing coasters, customization and variety. The customization aspect of RMC is very important. They can design their coasters to fit in almost any space given to them, and they will always meet the specification given by the park. RMC currently only have a few roller coaster types, and another one has just been announced which could fit Alton Towers' needs perfectly. They currently have the most popular design being the iBox track, which are on coasters such as Iron Guazi and Steel Vengeance. They also have a design known as a topper track. This specific design essentially means that most components on the roller coaster are still wooden. However, the top of the rails are made out of steel, hence the fact it's called a topper track. They've also expanded into the family throw category with single rail coasters coasters, which believe it or not, only have one single rail which the train traverses. This type is specifically known as an RMC Raptor. RMC Raptors only have one rider per row, whereas there is a concept design RMC have been working on known as the RMC T-Rex, which is essentially a bigger RMC Raptor with two riders per row instead of just one. However, last Friday they announced a totally new family thrill coaster type, which is called the Wild Moose Family Coaster. And this is where it gets interesting. The Wild Moose Family Coaster design is a small, compact, and essentially reimagined Wild Mouse. And this would be absolutely perfect for a space such as what they're working with on Project Horizon. And it would also be perfect for Alton Towers' target demographic, which is family through. That being said, RMC single rails would also fit perfectly into a compacted space. For example, the area they're working on for Project Horizon. I can't really believe I'm sat here saying Alton Towers might be getting an RMC. 
Right, let's get realistic for a sec. If Alton Towers was to get an RMC, it more than likely wouldn't be a crazy hybrid roller coaster which break records and is really intense. We're more than likely to get a tamer family coaster, but we know that Alton Towers love their coaster records. I mean, the smile opened with the most inversions on any roller coaster, being 14. Wicker Man is the world's first coaster to feature wooden fire. Rita opened as the fastest accelerating coaster in the whole of Europe. Nemesis was the first inverted roller coaster in Europe. 13 opened as the world's first coaster to feature a vertical drop track. Galactica was the world's first BNM flying coaster. Oblivion was the world's first dive coaster. And Project Horizon, well, we don't know what record it will break, but I'm certain it will join the Big Seven with another record. RMC or not, 2025 will be a very exciting year for Alton Towers with Project Horizon. Yes, John Burton might just be pulling our leg about this whole RMC thing, but who knows? Only time will tell. Drop a comment with what you think Project Horizon will be. Subscribe to keep updated with Alton Towers' possible RMC. And thanks for watching. Until next time.